the Dodgers took Game 1 of the National League Division Series presented by T-Mobile with a 95 win Friday night over the D-backs. We were on the scene from Dodger Stadium, 159 a.m. E.T. Turner stays hot, makes history make no mistake Justin Turner loves hitting in October. The Dodgers' third baseman tied a franchise record with five RBIs in Game 1, launching a three-run homer in the first inning against D-back starter Taiwan Walker, before tacking on RBI singles in the fourth and eighth. Turner joined Pedro Guerrero and Davey Lopez as the only Dodgers to knock in five runs in a postseason game. Guerrero did so in Game 6 of the 1981 World Series, after Lopez had done so in Game 1 of the 78 Fall Classic 135 a.m. E.T. think Puig is having fun Yasiel Puig hustled out a triple off David Hernandez to lead off the seventh inning and celebrated with an ecstatic tongue wagging after a head-first slide. The triple was Puig's fastest tracked by StatCast at 11.20 seconds, Puig.gif. Pick.twitter.com equals 6v4h, MLB GIFs at MOB GIFs October 7, 2017 Full throttle to third base at Yaziel Pug gives the at Dodgers crowd a thrill with his fastest 3b recorded by StatCast 11.20 seconds, runner pick.twitter.com Kazi JLX 22 VP, StatCast at StatCast October 7, 2017 120 AM. E.T. Kershaw stung in 7th evidently, Clayton Kershaw and the 7th inning of postseason bowl games do not mix well. Kershaw cruised through six frames Friday night, but Kettle Mart and Jeff Mathis greeted him with back-to-back -back dingers in the seventh both lasers down the left field line. Kershaw exited after 6-13, having allowed four runs on five hits. He's just the ninth pitcher in history to allow four homers in a postseason game. You Darvish, now his teammate, most recently did so for Texas in last season's ALDS. Kershaw is first pitcher to give up four homers in a postseason game against an NL team. That is not how it was supposed to go, Joe Posnanski at J. Posnanski October 7, 2017 110.9 Mph Kettlemart joins the FD backs home run party with the hardest HR of his career, a frozen rope into the LF seats. Pick.twitter.com Fuan Wap Expose, StatCast at StatCast October 7, 2017 110am. E.T. Van takes it all and Van Scully is certainly missed in the Dodgers broadcast booth but the legendary broadcaster remains a huge fan of the boys in blue. Scully got a huge ovation from the crowd when showed on the video board at Dodger Stadium while enjoying Game 1. A fan who has earned a nice night at the ballpark. Pick.twitter.com or Fsuo Gafu, MLB GIFs at Mope GIFs October 7, 2017, 12.50 a.m. E.T. Martinez keeps smashing in postseason. J.D. Martinez hit four homers at Dodger Stadium on September 4. He added another in the top of the sixth against Clayton Kershaw, a towering blast into the left field seats that cut the Dodgers' lead to 72. Martinez homer which traveled a projected 385 feet with a 36-degree launch angle was just the fifth against a Kershaw curveball this season. And it wasnt a particularly bad pitch. But Martinez, who now has 30 homers since coming to Arizona at the trade deadline, turned around the breaking ball below his knees and deposited it just inside the foul pole. At Jate Martinez 14 opens his postseason homer account and pulls the D-backs a run closer. Or season picked out twitter.com 2W4GW6XT1, Arizona Diamondbacks at D-backs October 7, 2017 12.24 a.m. E.T. Turner fuels another big frame for L.A. Justin Turner hits everything. His three-run dinger in the first came on a fast ball at the knees. Then, facing Zach Godley in the fourth, he tacked on an RBI single on a curveball that started at his hands. Turner fought it off and punched a single in two center, part of a three-run frame that put the Dodgers up, 71. He's the fourth Dodger in history to record four RBIs in a postseason opener and the first since James Loney in 2008. Turner needs one more RBI to match the club's postseason record, held by Pedro Guerrero and Davey Lopez. Everything s coming up at Dodgers so far. NLD's watch live on at TBS Network. Pick.twitter.com jd 6 tvnr MLB at MLB October 7, 2017, at Red Turn 2 knocks in a run, with a single to center and the Dodgers now lead, 61. Pick.twitter.com can 7xjs6 at K, Los Angeles Dodgers at Dodgers October 7, 2017 1157 p.m. E.T. Dodgers have pitching legend on their side the postseason brings out many famous faces to watch October baseball. For example, LeBron James was cheering on the Indians Thursday during their 40 win over the Yankees.
And in Los Angeles, a pitching legend took in a ball game Hall of Fame pitcher Sandy Koufax. The legend is in the building. HTTPS T.Coy 9 PVX VT 8 BL, cut for it, cut for October 7, 2017, 11.40 p.m. E.T. Pollock puts power on display. Clayton Kershaw cruised through the D-backs order once, but A.J. Pollock greeted the Dodgers ace with a solo homer on the first pitch of his second at-bat. It was the first hit of the night against Kershaw, who struck out six of the first nine hitters he faced. In 33 career regular season plate appearances, Pollock had never taken Kershaw deep. He now has three hits all four extra bases in seven at-bats this postseason. D-backs are on the board thanks to a solo jack by A.J. Poe 11 -Oc. Pick.twitter.com from 1BX2P, two Arizona Diamondbacks at D-backs October 7, 2017 10.50 p.m. E.T. Turner takes Walker deep Justin Turner wasted no time finding his usual scorching postseason form. The Dodgers' third baseman launched a three-run home run in the foreign first inning for Los Angeles against D-back starter Taiwan Walker. Since joining the Dodgers in 2014, Turner is now slashing .368.478.667 in parts of five playoff series. But he did and do it alone. Each of the first five Dodgers reached base, including Yasiel Puig, who brought home Cody Bellinger with an RBI double. Walker would finally escape after 48 pitches and nine batters faced, with the Dodgers leading 40. What a way to start the postseason hands clapping and LDS this team picked out twitter.com deatnil 16g, Los Angeles Dodgers at Dodgers October 7, 2017 1025 p.m. ET honoring the fallen a moment of silence is held prior to the game for the victims of the Las Vegas shooting, 1020 p.m. E.T. Newcomb throws first pitch. Don Newcomb opens the festivities by throwing out the first pitch before game 1. 1.015 p.m. E.T. players introduced. Kershaw takes focus as the players are introduced on the field. Dodgers ace Clayton Kershaw preps for first pitch. 9.44 p.m. E.T. strolled on memory lane. Fans need to get their game faces on too. 9.33 p.m. E.T. finishing touches the Dodger Stadium grounds. Crew prepares the infield for play. Would NT want to be those baseballs? JD28pick.twitter.com or 8PJMWH5I, Arizona Diamondbacks at D-backs October 7, 2017 9 p.m. ET drawing a crowd members of the media watch as the Dodgers take the field for batting practice. 914 p.m. ET, we could be in store for one heck of a series Hall of Famer Dennis Eckersley gives a radio interview before Game 1. 908 p.m. E.T. Go Time The Shirt says it all. As always, a beautiful evening at Dodger Stadium. Playoff baseball soon. Pick.twitter.com Vamob94 Joshua Thornton at Joshua Thornton underscore October 7, 2017 633 p.m. E.T. Lineup Set D-Backs Lineup David Peralta L.F.A.J. Pollock C.F. Paul Goldschmidt 1. B.J.D. Martinez R.F. Brandon Dury, 2B Adam Rosales, 3B Kettle Mart, SS Jeff Mathis, C Taiwan Walker, P Dodgers Lineup Chris Taylor, CF Corey Seeger, SS Justin Turner, 3B Cody Bellinger, 1B Yasiel Puig, RF Curtis Granderson, LF Yasmani Grandel, C Logan Forsyth, 2B Clayton Kershaw, P623 PM. ET All the pertinent info for anyone needing confirmation that the postseason has indeed arrived. 615 PM. ET Scene Setter Dodger Stadium is getting ready to raise the curtain on the NLDS.